gosh, how long have we known Mr. C? Uh, we've known him a lot of years now. Our names are Susie and Ben Perez, and we've known Mr. C since Chris and Jess got married back in, I don't know, 2004 or something like that. Yeah. And Jess, his daughter, has been my best friend ever since, and I love her to death and Mr. C to death, and we would just do anything for their family to help them. Love them so much. Such nice people. Mr. C is a stand-up guy and deserves everything that everyone's doing for him. She said exactly what I was about to say. Mr. C is one of the nicest, most genuine men I've ever met in my life. He's he's a great guy, and when when this happened, we wanted to do anything we could to help. Yeah, yeah we love the Castillos. God bless him. John and Gloria, we're just so happy to be a part of this event, and we're so thankful to God that you are in remission, and we just pray for your healing. And this was a wonderful day, and just God bless everything that's going on here, and we love you. We love you, cousins. You've always been here for us, and we'll always be here for you, too. We love you so much. Hey, John, it's Marty. Just want to tell you how much we miss you and we love you. I'm praying for you every day. You know that. Um, I hope this benefit will help you in any which way you need help. Um, we miss you at the house watching the Astros and the Cowboys. Um, but anyway, hopefully you'll be back to yourself in no time. Hi, John. This is Gil, or Deacon Gil, I should say, newly ordained. Um, uh, we've known each other for, for many years. I remember talking to you um, about uh, good homilies and just things around the church. Um, you and I were in a parish council. You were president and I was vice president. Um, I've, I've truly um, benefited from your friendship and uh, I wish you all the best. Uh, I pray for you on a regular basis and um, I, I hope that your recovery is full and complete. Um, so take care. Bye-bye. Hello, John. We just want to say God bless you. Uh, we're very blessed to have you in our lives. I've known you for, gosh, 20 years maybe. Um, you've been there for us uh, for quite a while, and uh, can't, I'll always remember when uh, we had our wedding in Oaxaca, and you really made the event uh, special and memorable with everything you did for us. And we thank you very much from the bottom of our hearts for all that you've done for us. We're happy that you're in remission and we hope that you continue to heal and we're always thinking of you and praying for you. And um, we wanted to be here today. Like Carlos said, you've you've been at every major event for us, our, from our wedding to our big uh, reveal party for when he was in my, stump, my tummy and... Um, Every major event of our lives you've been a part of, and so we wanted to be here for you today. We love you, and we hope you continue to heal. God bless you, John. Hi, John. We just wanted to uh, tell you thank you for inviting us to this. We are so grateful to God that he has healed you. We just pray for your continued um, healing, and we are just so blessed to have you in our lives. You truly are an angel on earth. Um, and we just can't thank you enough for being in our lives and being for so wonderful. We love you. Bethany and Matthew, um, you know, Bethany's in Nebraska and Matthew is at a party today, but we love you so much, John. Hi, John uh, and Gloria. This is uh, Chris and, and uh, I'm going to let everybody introduce themselves, but we're just, just wanting to, to be here with you as family to let you know that uh, we love you and we care about you. And for me and from me um, as a fellow cancer survivor, I just, uh, I just really am so proud that you are such a fighter, John. And uh, just keep it up, man. And, and you just really make us all proud. Godspeed, John. Cousin Carrie, just wanted to say that you guys are all in our prayers every single day. Um, we're so happy to be here and be a part of this with you. And we love you and we pray for you every day. So God bless you all. It's Freddie. I, I just got to tell you something kind of funny. Um, you introduced me to Rudy. So that was uh, the introduction, I guess, the whole family thing. And then you stood back and uh, was laughing about it. So <laughs> I found out the whole, uh, the whole spiel with, with Rudy. But uh, honestly, you've always been really classy. And I know you're a fighter, so go get him. It's Ariel. Um, just, you know, I wanted to say keep fighting and God bless. This is our youngest grandson. 
Gloria. I'm Roger Sanguinetti. Um, really happy to be here. Help out. God bless you, John. Uh, we're so glad that we could all be here. I think Roger would be here too. I mean, Trey Trey, uh, Carrie's other child, he's in college getting ready to get his bachelor's. Charles Allen, as you know, he and Lisa are in California and they send their best. I want you to know that we did get 15 tickets to this barbecue and I have to also thank um, John John and Sherry and also Lindsay, Barbara's uh, child. Uh, they also contributed to that. They couldn't be here, but they're glad to contribute. Tribute. Love you so much. Bye bye. Hi, this is Gina Waters, and I've known John for six, seven years as uh, a Marian servant, and we love him. Uh, he's a, a wonderful uh, supporter of the people in his life, and we want to be here to support him too today. And hi, John, Cindy Stegemeyer, and I'm so happy to see you looking so great and just continue to pray for you for full, complete recovery and that you'll be back with all of us and the Marian Servants very soon. John, it was great to see you, even if only briefly today. I hope you're inside staying cool and we're really enjoying ourselves out here and, and glad you're looking so good and doing so well. Thinking back to when we first got the news and things look kind of bleak, it really has been a miracle. So wonderful. Praise be to God and hope you continue doing better and better every day. Hey John, this is Mark. I just want you to know we've been praying for you and uh, so I, I, I've heard about you for years and years from Cindy and just what, what a wonderful guy you are. So we're praying for you and pulling for you. So stay in there and get, get well. Hello from all the Marian servants. Did we do the five finger salute? Oh, we'll do the five finger um, oh. What is it? The five finger prayer. Yeah. Ready? <laughs> Lord, I am totally yours. Lord, I am totally yours. Lord, I am totally yours. Totus to us. <laughs> hey, John. It's Rosie and Jennifer. Wanted to tell you that I have you in my prayers every day. We came out here to be there for you. We love you. And Alma sends her love. She wanted me to tell you hello. Juan asked me to say hello to you too as well. Uh, he has you in, your, in his prayers every day. Um, get well. We want to see you healthy again. We love you. Get well soon, John. Hello. My name is Ralph, Ralph Jones. And this is Richard Pettis. We just want to wish John the best in his treatments and uh, tell him to keep the faith that everything will, will, will turn out fine in the long run. Keep on being his uh, good old self. He takes charge of any event that went on. He is the Speaker of the House. He's always good. He's a man that can really talk behind the mic. He is a great speaker. I wish I was half the speaker he was. Thank you. Well, hi, John. Uh, this has been a marvelous experience. Hope that, uh, hope that we raise a, a lot of money for you and your, your continued battle. Uh, we'll continue to keep you in our prayers every single night. Uh, by the way, George and Barbara Lewandowski. And uh, we enjoyed this tremendously. And, and Lord, Lord, love you. And, and again, we'll continue to keep you in our prayers each and every night. And if there's anything that Barbara, I, or Zach can do for you, please don't hesitate to call. Love you, brother. Love you, John. All right. Thanks, John. God bless you. Bye. Hey, John, this is uh, Tom and Edith Harrell. We just wanted to tell you we're honored that we got invited to be out here. Um, we had a wonderful time. We uh, will keep you in our prayers and continue to, um, you know, I'll tell you right now, we miss you. We missed having you at our ACTS retreats and just know you're always in our hearts. We love you a bunch. Bye. Okay. John, look, I found a Mexican. <laughs> John, I found Damon. He was lost all this time. Uh, he went to China, then from China he went to... Uh, Mexico, and then from there, he, I think he's going to go Sweden. 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 So next time when he comes back in, we'll drag him in. Uh, come. Uncle John, I hope you feel a lot better. I hope you get well, which you will. I know you will. God is great. Later. Take care. Hi, my name is Angie Bala. This is my daughter on my right, Britannia, left Bianca and her boyfriend, Paul. 
Uncle John, I remember one time, this was after I finished pharmacy school, we all went out to dinner and we ate at an Italian restaurant. And I remember you told me how proud you were of me for going back to school. And I've always just considered you part of my family, even though we may not be blood re related. I really just appreciated all the kind words that you always said to me, just about being very determined and uh, being able to finish school. And we just hope that you've got a speedy recovery and that your health will be, you'll be successful and the cancer will be gone and not come back any longer. That's it, we love you. Yes. Hey, John, Ignacio here, Nana, Yvonne, and Jason, and my grandkids. Hey, we're happy for you. I'm glad that you are cancer-free. Hey, I love those prayers you said. I know they mean a lot to you and mean a lot to us. So uh, keep Christ in, in, in your heart, and and he will He will do miracles, man. That's that's the way it is, buddy. And I know you're you're faithful. You're a good a good man. And take care. I love you, John. Be good, man. Bye. Uh, we just want to thank everyone that's uh, donated and uh, volunteered and uh, spent their time helping out with whether it's the uh, benefit or uh, cooking or items that were donated. Uh, just thank everyone for your support, and uh, we just pray that uh, it, that we'll get through this. Thanks again. John does so much for everybody else, and it's really good to see everybody come through for John when he needs their help. It's, it's a real uplifting experience to see a great person held up by other great people in the, his community. And we love John so much, and we're so glad that everybody's come through. And thanks again, and thank you for your continued support, and we look forward to seeing everybody. Thanks.